everyone, Daisy here again with another Christmas card lift. The series that I'm doing from Jennifer from Kay's Mom. And today we have a special guest, um, Christy from Christy's Beautiful Life joining us. Um, and she actually picked out our card for this week. So we are card lifting the beautiful card that you saw at the beginning from Jennifer Smith. And um, it's a lovely card with that beautiful flower and the little peekaboo part. And... Yeah, so I just kind of went to town here. I am starting with a craft um, kind of card base, and then I am cutting down this Bella Boulevard paper to create my card. This is actually going to go together pretty fast because I had created one already, but apparently never hit record, so it didn't actually record the process. So this one was a lot uh, faster because I knew what I was doing. So I cut down my card base to 4.5, no, 4.25 by 5.5 I think is what it is. And um, I'm just cutting some strips here to use kind of on the side, like um, is in the inspiration card. And these papers are from Bella Boulevard, like I said, it's from one of the 6x8 paper pads and it just works out perfectly. I love the colors. So I'm using this um, Blueprint Sketch Distress Oxide Ink to stamp my sentiment, which says Hap Hap Happy Christmas. And then I'm going to adhere down um, the top part of this paper. And I'm just using ATG and just making sure to not adhere around where I cut that slit to do the little peekaboo part. And then I'm going to fold it back um, eventually after I get the rest of my strips um, adhered down. And I just picked a couple of colors that went with uh, the rest of the card. I really liked this um, kind of candy cane stripe and so I did a little bit of that. And I just used uh, Tombow for that just because it was too thin for my ATG to fit on it. So uh, now, I don't know where I went right now, but um, I'm going to roll these over and um, use my stapler to staple them down. And so I'm just working on the front of my card and I will adhere it to a card base um, after I'm finished with it. So the back side of those staples will be covered up. So I'm just searching through uh, my flowers and I don't actually find one that I like in there, um, but I do have another package of flowers and they're from Prima. And I'm gonna end up using one of those. I thought maybe I could layer up a couple of these and make it look okay, but in the end I don't like the way it looks. I'm going to apologize if you can hear my washing machine. Um, I tried to make it be quiet, but I can't stop it because we have got so much laundry, so um, I've got to keep it going. But anyway, I'm going to end up putting that flower on there using some glue dots, and then that's pretty much going to be the end of this card. So I want to thank you so much for watching. Thank you for supporting this um, series that we're doing. Don't forget to head on over and check out Jennifer's card, and then also check out Christie's. I will have linked down below to both of their channels. Um, and yeah, I really love how these turned out. They're nice and fun, and I chose some bright, like, non-traditional colors and I just really like how it turned out so um, go check out the other ladies and see what they create um, and see how they compare so thank you so much for watching I'll see you again next time bye